डिविसन अफ डेसिमेल नम्बर्स ओके आई हाव डिडेड द डिविसन अफ डेसिमेल्स इंटू फोर कैटेगरिज कैटेगरि नम्बर वन इज डिविसन अफ ए डेसिमेल नम्बर बै ए नेचारे नम्बर ओके लुक एट दिस here i am telling divided by a natural number instead of whole number why because we know natural numbers along with zero are whole numbers but uh, in division we can't divide any number by zero there is no solution um, any non zero number divided by zero is undefined so naturally Uh, we have taken uh, natural number for excluding zero okay so that's why <coughs> we divide uh, decimal number by a natural number okay so here you see steps i have written steps this is step number 1 divide the given decimal number by treating it as a whole number by the given natural number okay first step is simple just like multiplication Uh, formula is to ignore the decimal point and uh, here we'll think um, that uh, this dividend part is just like a normal whole number ignoring this point and divide it like 4239 divided by 12 we'll think like this okay here it's uh, step number 2 mark the decimal point in the quotient when the division of the whole number part of the given decimal is complete and continue the process of division as in the case of whole numbers okay let's continue the sum 4239 divided by 12 uh, we'll think that this point is not here and just like normal division i'm doing here 12 3 is a 36 so 41 is 36 is 6 now here the this decimal point is here and we will mark the decimal point in the quotient when the division of the whole number part is uh, complete so here this whole number part is complete so we will mark this decimal point just above here this is just above this point here there will be a decimal point so marking the decimal point is over so now we will just continue our uh, And this uh, division like a normal process and uh, now i am uh, bringing down this 3 here 3 okay so 5 12 sir now 60 60 60 is 3 now i'm dropping down this 9 here now this 12 3 is 36 Thirty-nine minus thirty-six is three. Now here I'm going to share a very important thing with you. So uh, please listen it carefully. A given decimal number upon division by a given natural number gives a non-zero remainder. Yes, non-zero remainder. then we can introduce as many zeros on the right of the decimal part of the given decimal number as necessary to make the last remainder zero but uh, one thing remember only one zero at a time otherwise for adding extra zero we need to add zero in the quotient also all right in this case i am adding zero here so this is this becomes 30 12 2 are 24 30 minus 24 is 6 again by the rule of division i am this here 10 adding here 10 now 12 uh, 5 sir 60 now here you see there is no remainder that means zero so our sum is complete okay now category number 2 division of a whole number by a decimal number 
okay step number one convert the divisor into a natural number by multiplying the divisor by 10 100 1000 etc depending on the number of decimal places in the divisor okay for example 675 divided by 1.5 here divisor is 1.5 which is a decimal number and 675 is a whole number now for dividing with a decimal number it will be very uh, difficult to count the tables of a decimal number instead it will remain easy to count the tables of a natural number so what will you do we'll just convert this uh, decimal number into a natural number um, by removing the point and um, for this what to do exactly we need to uh, multiply the divisor with uh, 10 if it contains one decimal place with 100 if it contains two decimal places and so on now in this case you see here this divisor contains one decimal place so that means we will have to multiply this uh, divisor with uh, 10 and at the same time we need to multiply our dividend also with 10 so i'm multiplying here 1.5 into 10 is equal to 15 and 675 into 10 is equal to 6750 so our new question will be like 6750 divided by 15 so this is step number one so step number two divide the number by the divisor just like normal division so now it becomes pretty easy and just like normal division i'm dividing 15 4 sir 60 then 7 5 then 5 15 sir 75 this is 0 0 sir, 0 so what is the answer our answer is equal to 4 5 0 Okay.